Could you come in here, please? Miss Medley, Miss Medley, that was my grandmother. She thinks I'm the smartest man in the world. I am the editor of this newspaper. She wants me to have a story in the Sunday edition about Pog. That's all she talks about. Pog, Pog, Pog. I don't even know what Pog is. Miss Medley, Miss Medley, could you please tell me what is Pog? Well, sir, Pog is a. Well, Pog is, is a. Let me tell you. Pog is a cross between a pig and a dog. It is? Isn't it? We don't know what Pog is, sir. Get the guys in the newsroom. They'll have the answer. Hello, newsroom. Do you boys know anything about Pog? Frogs? Sure, we know lots about frogs. Ribbit, 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 ribbit. Not frogs, hog. Hog? Yeah, we just did a story on the rainforest. Did you know that in every 24 hour period, Listen, there are more you trees? knuckleheads. I don't want a story on frogs. I don't want a story on logs. And no, I don't want a story on pigs and dogs. I want a story on pog, and I want it now. Do I make myself clear? Now, get going. I want that story, and I want it now. Where do we get these guys? All right, all right. Who do we have that's young? I'm young, sir. Who do we have that's smart? Oh, I'm smart, sir. Who do we have that's young and smart and could get to the bottom of this pog story? Well, sir, you know, most of our reporters are even older than you are, and you know how smart they are. Hey, wait a minute. What? They just hired somebody new in the mailroom. They say he's bright. They say he's hip. They say he's perfect for the job. Well, actually, he was the only one who showed up for the interview. Could, Could he, he be, be the, the new, new reporter? reporter? What's this guy's name? Winkleman, sir. Herbie Winkleman, sir. Herbie J. Winkleman, sir. Well, let's get Herbie in here. Herbie J. Winkleman, we need you in Mr. Tor's office right, right away. away. Winkleberg, I have an assignment for you. It's Winkleman, sir. Yes, yes, whatever. What do you know about Pog? A Pog, sir? Uh, nothing. Well, Pinkleman, you need to find out everything you can find out about Pog. I don't care where you go, I don't care who you talk to, but bring me the story of Pog for the Sunday edition. And Pinkleberg, don't let me down. <laughs> Yes, sir, Mr. Tor. I can do it. I will do it. I must do it. I will leave no stone unturned. I will look hither and yon. I will go searching for Pog. Hello, Mr. Tor? Remember, Winklemeyer, we're all counting on you. Yes, sir, you can count on me, for I am Herbert J. Winkleman. Hello? And Finkleton, good luck. How does he know where to find me? <laughs> Hello, doll, welcome to the diner. My name is Stella, I'll be glad to take your order. Oh, you are so cute. 
what can I get for you today, sweetheart? Coffee. We have a triple meatloaf omelet special that comes with wheat toast. You can have butter, jam, jelly. You want your toast dry? How do you want that, doll? Coffee. Just coffee? Oh, that's easy. Pog. Hmm. How do I find Pog? Pog? Oh, that's so simple, hon. All you have to do is go talk to the old wise man who sits atop of the mountain looking out over the empty wide spaces. You know, my brother in Jersey used to be considered a wise man. I don't know what happened, whether there were too many wise men in Jersey or whether or not he got, em I don't, he got unemployed somehow. Now he's working in a deli cutting pastrami. He's actually much happier. He can take care of his family. Indeed, I have found you, O man of all knowledge, of truth, of light, for I've been told that you are all seeing the main man, the top dog, the head honcho, the big cheese, the chief, the king, the gipper, the pitcher, the catcher, the quarterback, the... This is so, my bumbling bee. Then you know why I'm here? But of course, my seeking centipede, you are here to find out about... Uh, about... About... I knew you'd know. What must I do? Where must I go? Who must I see? I see everything, and I see nothing. I hear everything, and I hear nothing. I feel everything, and I feel nothing. Oh, Master, what does this mean? I have no idea, but I felt it was a wise thing to say. I will now tell you what you must do before falling off the cliff, my little web of spiders. You must fly on the wings of a large silver bird. Uh, how about if I just catch a plane? And you must go to the great island surrounded by water. I thought all islands were surrounded by water. Pay heed to the wise old fisherman. For it is he who holds the answer. Seek, and ye shall find. Search, and you shall locate. Hurry, or you'll miss your point. Aloha, and welcome to Hawaii. Sir, yes, I've just arrived to search for the elusive pog. I want an answer, and I want it now. I will leave no stone unturned. I will leave no corner of the earth unsearched, no bases unfielded, no pitches unpitched, no catchers uncaught, no strikes unstruck. For I, Herbert J. Winkleman, will strive, will seek, will fulfill. Now get going. Yes, sir. I'll keep you posted. Excuse me, sir. You're excused. Oh, excuse me, sir. Yes. Can you help me locate Pog? 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 Oh, certainly. It's very simple. All you do is take the white color to Monolani. That's about two blocks down the road. About 13 blocks after that, if you want to turn right, left, and right again. Now you're at the T-junction. Turn around, go straight forward, and straight back till you're behind yourself, okay? Now you're at the Kalakakai Circle. Go around it three times till you're back where you started. Got it so far? Got it. Good, because this is where it begins to get really complicated. White Kaloa. I, I thought we are at the Kanakakai. Who's giving the directions? You are. You. Good. And as I was saying, the Kona Poly goes from that poly to Poly Wana Cracker. And at the Aina Haina and the Hanley Highway, you will surely find plenty of fog. Got it? Got it. Good. Good. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Stinkleton? That's me. I'm Winkleman. Thank you. Stinkleton? Yes, Mr. Tor? Have you searched? Yes. I have searched. Sought? I have sought. Looked? I have looked. Super and superb. I knew this boy was great the minute I laid my full eyes on him. <laughs> well now, my boy, can you tell me the meaning of paw? Well, no. No? Well, not exactly. Not exactly? I knew this kid was worthless the minute I laid eyes on him. But I do have a lead. The boy has uh, a lead! Uh... Fish! Fish. Fish. The fish! The fish! I must interview the fish! I'll talk to you later, Mr. Tor. Bye-bye. The fish? Why would he want to interview the fish? For it is the fish, and the fish alone, that have the answer. It is the fish that swim. It is the fish that fry. I must interview the fish. All fish of the ocean, all fish of the sea, where have I gone? Oh, please tell me. The cows, the cows, I must interview the cows. Cows? I'm beginning to wonder about this boy. So are we. Ah, derriere. But wait, the cows, the cows, I must speak to the cows. Oh, cows, oh, cows. Moo Moo, I must speak to the lady in the Moo Moo. Hi, excuse me. Can you tell me where I can find Pog? Pog? Oh, you must go to the plant. The plant, the plant, I must go to the plant. Hello? No, no, not that plant, that plant. I knew that. The plant, the plant, I will go to the plant. <laughs> in the bag, <laughs> or should I say, in the carton. Pog is a drink. Pog, it's a drink. I knew it all the time. Pog, P-O-G. Passion. 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 Orange. Orange, just as I suspected. Guava. Guava, knew it all along. Drinkleman, hold on. Hi, honey. Yes, love you too. Guess what? I got a big surprise for you. I have the story of Pod. Pod is a drink. You, you knew it was a drink, but you want the story of Pod the game? Well, I thought I'd start with the drink and then progress to the game. Okie dokie. Okay, love you too. Bye bye. Bye bye. Winkleburger, I know it's a drink. I need to find out about Pog the game. <laughs> the game, I knew that. Well, I thought I would start with the drink and then progress to the game. I'm close. He's close. Closer. Closer. Closest. Closest? Closest. I'm searching for Pog even as we speak. Finkleton, good luck. Yes, sir. You must search further, my Spartan dog. You! You're the wiser old fisherman that the wise old man told me about, and now I have found you. Yes, you have found me, my little running rabbit. But you must go further. You must go deeper. You must go higher. 
I will go further. I will go deeper. I will go higher. I will go shower. We interrupt this program for a special report. Blog Mania is sweeping the country. They flip them, they slam them, they collect them. I'm Kirby J. Winkleman. I'm searching for pugs. Won't stop till I find it. I'll hunt like a dog. Woof, 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 woof. It all started in Hawaii years ago. When I was a little girl, maybe about four or five years old, milk used to be delivered in bottles. And at the mouth of the bottle, there was a little disc. And as children, we'd save those discs. So whenever the milk was delivered, whoever got to that milk bottle first got to lick cream off the bottom. And they got to hang on to that milk cover and use it in the game. You know, we called it the milk cover game. The dairy started uh, remaking the milk covers uh, in the early 70s as a promotional device uh, to go along with the pog juice. And it's gone through waves of interest and excitement over the last 20 years. And then bananas, two years ago, somebody else has to tell me what happened, I don't know. Pog's not only a game, but it's a collectible. We know of a lady, for example, in Hawaii, the largest collection that we're aware of, she has 52,000, and that uh, was a few months ago, so I'm not sure how much she's collected since then, but it's a big collectible item. You can buy a simple milk cap for five cents to several thousand dollars for authentic milk caps. And so I think that one of the reasons that kids have gravitated towards Pog is that they feel like this is their game. This is the game of the 90s. Once it was hula hoops, now it's Pog. All I can say is just slam on, you know. We now return you to our regularly scheduled program. I look good, I feel good, I am good. I, Herbert J. Winkleman, will find Pog. It'll be a breeze. that has been asked of me. I've climbed the highest mountain. I've swam the deepest sea. Oh, please, please, please. Oh, wisest of the wise. Oh, holiest of the holy. Tell me where to seek Pog. There are but two ways to find that which you seek. I'm all ears. And your nose isn't that small either, my flapping chicken. Now, you could slay the dreaded dragon in the cavernous cave, thus saving the merry maiden, Mary. Slay the dreaded dragon in the cavernous cave? Isn't that dreadfully dangerous? Definitely. Is there an alternative? Simply go to any corner store, anywhere, anytime, and you will surely find Pog. <laughs> Any questions? Mr. Editor needed a 
story about Paul for a Sunday edition inside the travel log. He asked his secretaries, but they were in a fog. So he said, Herbie J. Winkleman searching for Pog. Searching for Pog? Herbie J. Winkleman searching for Pog. Just the juice. Herbie J. Winkleman searching for. 